Oh my God, y'all. I just had to come up out of that damn Dave and Buster's. It was too many white people in there. I'm sorry, I can't do it. Whew. Like, I don't know what the fuck this man is trying to pull, but he's a black Freemason, right? Now y'all know these people done did me and my children so wrong. And black people thought they were gonna sit there and throw me up under the bus. So, I don't wanna be around certain motherfuckers. And they still keep trying to be around me. And I don't like that shit. If you're not gonna do right by me and my kids, then like I said, there's a lot of people trying to say shit to me. And honestly, I don't even wanna talk to the motherfuckers because if you ain't stood up for me and my children, then you don't even got nothing to say to me. Like, that's, that's, that's what it is. If you ain't stood up for me, if you ain't been by my side standing up for me and my kids, then you ain't at least standing up for my little boy. Then, nah, uh, you know, please, standing up for us like God did. If you ain't did that, then, nah, uh, you, you, ain't, you ain't cool. So, um, damn, I don't know if this man, uh, car is open. So, basically, um, they done, he done brought me to this damn restaurant, and he's a Freemason. I don't want to be around him, you know, so people trying to, like, make me have to be around people, like, I don't want to be around him. Okay, somebody helping me, that's cool, but they worship white people, and they try to roll that shit on you, like, no, I'm going through some shit with me and my children, and I'm going to fight for me and my children. And I'm not finna get around no black men and be up under them to where they think they gonna glaze the situation over for some white people. No, you're not. No, you're not. And I don't tell nobody my fucking business, but I already know people's agenda when I come around them with the bullshit. So, you know, now I'm in a restaurant full of them motherfuckers and he wanna try to get an attitude and act funny because I'm telling the lady, you need to come on with the food. I'm not finna be up in here playing around, playing no games. I done told this man, I don't play games like that. I don't, I don't play games like that. And I damn sure ain't finna be sitting up playing with a whole bunch of white people around. And they done did this shit to me and my children in this country. I said no. So motherfucker call me crazy. You can say whatever you want. I don't even go out with people. I damn sure don't, I'd rather you get my food and we can go to a park because you're not going to threaten my child. Y'all not going to threaten to do shit to my little boy and then I ain't seen my child and you think I'm finna be sitting up around them motherfuckers. I can go and get my food and come out. I can, I can deal. I can be cordial. But I'm not finna sit up around your people. I'm not finna sit up around your people, man. After my child was threatened and this lady done went through this court system on some racist bullshit, no, I'm not finna do that. And people are like, well, what do that have to do with being in a restaurant? It have a lot to do with it. Cause you're not gonna procrastinate. And they love to try to take up for the then I got a whole gang of white people behind me. I'm on my phone, they all behind me. And he trying to uh, distract me from being on my phone. Like, I'll come shoot some basketball. Do it look like I wanna shoot some motherfucking basketball? Um, that's not me. That's not me. You know what I'm saying? It's just, it's really not me. It could be any man in the world, and I still would not want to do that shit. Like, I'm not a kid anymore, and I don't feel comfortable in there around all those white people. I don't. I, I already don't like being around black people. I don't like being around nobody like that. If I'm not fucking you, and I, or we ain't just cool friends, one-on-one, like, because too many motherfuckers did me wrong. So, I'd rather go up in there. If we were going to eat, let's just eat, enjoy the dinner, and go. Because I'm not finna be sitting up there playing around with motherfuckers and they looking and knowing who I am. And they know, oh, you know, what happened with my situation and everybody just looking at me. Nah, get the fuck out of here. Cause you're not gonna take my child from me. And then everybody think they gonna run around and then be smiling up in my face. Now, I'm not finna do that. And they can be like, oh, you don't like to enjoy life. Ain't no enjoying life when you done gave my child to somebody because someone was abusing us. 
and this person done said all sorts of wickedness towards me and my children. So, no, nah, I'm not finna sit up playing around with people, kids. I'm not finna sit up playing around with no grown-ass Freemasons. No, hell no. Nah. They the ones who should have stopped the shit. And they the ones who should have come out the woodworks like, hell no, nah, don't take her son. Y'all know what time it was, you know, and then you're going to try to watch the mother go down the drain after you took her baby. That's some retaliation bullshit. You trying to make somebody go down the drain. You trying to hurt somebody. I done already shot his daddy. He was abusing us. Now you just trying to make the mother go even worse down here. These people don't give a fuck. They don't give a fuck. Then they want to run around with their kids, want to run around with their little girls. Want like, I give a fuck. I don't give a fuck about that shit. Now these niggas trying to show me, oh, what they buy their daughter, what they do for their daughter. I don't give a fuck because I was somebody's daughter with my son and we was being abused. So I don't give a damn about them running around with their kids. I don't give a damn about none of that bullshit. Not how that did me and my son. And this lady knew her son was up in there abusing us and gonna sit there and try to have the police not help us. What the fuck? You and then you got my child. You out your goddamn motherfucking mind. And my family out their motherfucking mind. Everybody out their motherfucking mind said, no, I don't need to be killed in no fucking jail cell. You need to give me back my child. That's what the fuck you need to do. And I'm tired of motherfuckers keep trying to tear me down in the motherfucking streets. Give me my baby. And then they want to see a fucking showdown about somebody's child. And we done already had the showdown about my baby. So we need to get my baby back to me and stop with all this hoeing with these bullshit and white folks sitting over there hoeing and shit. But all these black women sit there not helping me when they know I needed to get back on my feet try to let them folk keep my child. You wicked! They want to keep me around. Nothing but bad influence. Somebody that's going to try to uh, pretend like they cool with you and then try to discredit you as a mother for some bullshit-ass racist-ass pedophiles. And I'm tired of the fucking shit. So I'd rather just be outside. I'd rather just be outside. You know, I need to find a way to just give me some money. God already told me what I need to do. I'm just trying to keep my cool with folk because you're not finna catch no fucking attitude with me in a place where I don't even fucking want to be. I don't want to be up in there. I don't. And then that's why I don't fuck with those Freemason niggas. I don't. Because they know what time it is. They know Andre Jones ain't trying to be up in no fucking restaurant with full of fucking white girls and white men. Hell, what the fuck you mean? Get me the fuck up out of here. But I ain't being racist with you. Took my baby, white America. Because his white daddy was abusing us. And that was illegal because you did it while I was in there on the trial. And then show you how your family sit up and coon. It was so simple. The girl get out the jail, she want her baby, man. But see, my family didn't expect for me to make it out the fucking jail because you always got them wicked ass motherfucking women in your family that just hope the worst for your ass. And then when they hear about something happening to you, ooh, we, ooh, we, ha, uh, uh, ha. God already said I was getting out. God already said Cynthia was wrong for keeping me from my baby. So them wicked assholes could have kept that shit to themselves. Somebody could have just fucking helped us. But see, people want to see the destruction of you. They want to see your destruction. They don't want to fucking help you. Because their verdict wasn't what the fuck they wanted it to be. You want to try to destroy me by taking the boy. He was the whole reason why I was in the fucking jail, dumbass. Because somebody was hurting him. So what reason do you have to take my child? You ain't got no fucking reason to take my child from me. And they did it illegally. And what, I got to keep screaming and crying about my baby. While people keep trying to destroy me. And then motherfuckers sit over there trying to leave us vulnerable and shit. And I'm going to climb up out the motherfucking shit. But I'm sick and tired of motherfuckers. You ain't going to sit over there and try to start no motherfucking shit with me. This ain't your fucking battle. Don't try to unhand do that shit neither. Can't stay around these niggas too long. And I ain't giving this man no pussy. He is too old for me. He is too old. He 50-something years old. So they dead ass wrong for thinking that you was going to catch Andre Jones. Told you they asses is wicked, man. And I'm finna have to leave. So it's gonna get worse and worse. He gonna keep playing nice, gonna keep 
playing nice and keep trying to distract me from what my cause is. And that shit is abusive. And that's why I ain't stopped smoking no cigarettes since I fucking had realized none of the hospitals was going to help me and my baby. When I realized that they was chasing us around, they chased us all around the fucking country. Well, from Texas to here, to Atlanta. And then tried to do it here. And I'm sick of people staring me up in my fucking face. They always want to see some wickedness happen to somebody. And they want you to be so fucking happy for they ass about every little piece of shit thing they fucking do. And then they had niggas stealing my ID on purpose. Like, the shit that people try to do to one another. That's just that, that, that verse would say, the Lord is my shield, the lift of my head. So I got to sit in this motherfucking car until they bring that goddamn food out. I really rather cook for myself. Because I can't, I'm not finna sit up there with people all in up, up on me. White people all up on me. It's like, yeah, you need to give me my child. And then we could talk about being around. I don't want to be around them. They don't want me around. They don't want me around. I don't want. I don't want to be around them. I want my child.